once you can transfer consciousness and put it into things and then control that. It's frightening. <laughs> there was a crash. You and the kids died. Initiate. I brought you back. So this movie obviously deals with a lot of intense themes. One of the things, obviously, is consciousness. So if you could have your consciousness uploaded into anything, person, animal, thing. Good question, I like it. Yes. What would you want your consciousness uploaded into? Keanu. <laughs> <laughs> That's actually a fantastic answer, because who doesn't want to be Keanu? Right, Everybody I loves Keanu. My brain and him, and he'd go far. Oh <laughs> my imagine. gosh, do the I get to keep mine as go. well? No, so am I like, then, then we just like, talking all the time yeah, to each other? Yeah, that would be super Who was not that a movie with oh, uh, Steve Martin, The Man With Two Brains? Oh really? Yes. Yeah. I would say the leader of this country. Really? Yeah. Like that specific human being or just in general? Just the office. Okay. You would want that? Uh, like now. Yeah? Yeah. Why? Just because um, I think we could use a little more Leadership. kindness and love and I forgiveness like in this world. What would you go into? I don't... Uh, mine shouldn't go anywhere. That's I'm your kind belief. Of, yeah, mine, is, mine <laughs> should just be here and then when it's done it can just go to other places. So you don't feel any kind of compassion or understanding for what your character decided to do? Um, <laughs> no, because that character without giving away too much of what happens is being able by the technology to have a continuation of a relationship as a protector to, to his family. There's a bit of a tragedy to it but there's also a, a gift to it. I would say the forces that are taking that technology that are revealed in the picture to be the nefarious aspect of the piece. Once you can transfer consciousness and put it into things and then control that. It's frightening. <laughs> but that's also like, you know, some people say with the tech world, like just because you can do something, should you do it? I think this movie is a perfect example of that. I don't think should matters. Oh, okay. Because I think that we will. In some cases, I would want to do that, and in other cases, it would like scare the shit out of me. Right. But yet, I feel like if we can relieve pain mm -hmm. um, or unjust death. But the thing is, is, like the implications or the consequences of some of that, which we see in the movie, uh, is. Um, something that can be just as complicated, you know, so, or worse. Yeah. So I, personally, I'm more of a let nature take its course kind of a guy. But, you know, I mean, I have a 12-year-old and, you know, I'm not so sure I would be like, oh, yeah, okay. So life you, you find life that happens. a little relatable, but... Oh, yeah, absolutely. So many of us have lost friends or folks who have left us way too soon, you know? And yeah. We often wonder what it would be like to have another conversation with that person. Do you think that if you found out your husband or partner made a clone of you, that that would be grounds for divorcing them? I mean, I think the law would say so. Yeah, something would say so, yeah. yeah. But it doesn't... Maybe you'd love them more. I mean, it's a noble act, with, you know, his reasoning behind it because he loves his family so much. But it's also kind of... Well, I think, the, you know, the picture is, you know, one of the things it's saying is, like, what would you do? Yeah. You know, to your question, which is kind of, should we, I think is part of what would you do. So what would you do if you found out that you were a replica? Carry on. Carry on. Carry on. Keep calm and carry on. That's a big motto in my country. Yeah, you're British. I'm British. <laughs> we, we like that keep calm and carry on. Oh. Right, stiff up a lip. Never mind, I'm a replica. I know, but you would... <laughs> yeah, a little therapy. A little therapy. <laughs> Just a little. <laughs> a little therapy. But then it would also depend on the environment that you were born into or replicated into. Right? You mean if you were among other replicas? Yeah, or what is the situation? It's there? true, you would feel like you had your people. Yeah, or it would be part of something that is... It would help you carry on.